What's going on guys? So today we got a moving job. We got to pick up a two-piece couch. Um, right here in the local area, man. It's in Cold Springs, I believe. And then we're dropping it off in, I believe, in Deerfield or Delray. I forgot which one they told me. But well, we're picking that up. Um, it's a two-piece sofa. And we have to get an ottoman. And then we're taking, I guess, a, another sofa out of that same house. And bringing it to the house that we're dropping it off. So we're, it's a pickup, drop-off, pickup, drop-off. From A to B, back to A. All right, so that's what we're doing today. That's today's goal. Um, I charge him 110. Um, it's not gonna take me long. For one, it's not far. For two, he's gonna help me. So I, I'm saving money on bringing a worker or a friend help me out lift the couch. Because no matter how light the couch is, it's a couch. It's long. Get somebody to help you um, lift it up. So that's the goal today, guys. Um, today is not my day off from my regular job. I do work at night, overnight actually. So it's about 10:30 now. We're gonna head over to the, to the place. I gotta go to Ace Hardware pick up another. Um, furniture blanket because the one i had got messed up i left it in the rain and it's, it's all messed up i'm not gonna use it for customers so we're gonna show order ace hardware or maybe u-haul depending on the price pick up a blanket i already have a, one blanket there and that's it so without that here we go Okay, so I picked up the new moving blanket. Um, I also picked up another pair of gloves. It's five bucks. Hardy's some, what's it called? It's pretty cheap. Um, because all the gloves are worn. Look at that. Ugh. So, I picked up some new gloves. These are $5.99. Just to have some new gloves. Got the mat. I'm gonna grab something to eat real quick. And then we're gonna head off to the job. We'll be meeting the owner at his house. If I can record, if I'm able to record, as in like, I'm doing stuff. Um, I'll show you guys a few clips from there. If not, I'll, I'll show you guys once it's in the back of the truck. Um, so yeah, here it is. All right, guys, um, I got the sofa. I don't know if you see the blue tarp in the background. We're picking it up. Oh, we picked it up. We picked it up. We're going to drop it off now. Uh, yeah, that's. I mean, it's not, it's not really much to talk about. Just picking up a sofa, just dropping it off. The house is about 15 minutes away, so we're just driving there now to get everything finished. And then I think we're picking out one more couch and taking that somewhere else, but that's closer to my house. And that'd be it. So thanks for watching guys. I really appreciate everybody who enjoys this truck stuff. I mean, like I told you, you just wanna make some simple money and you own a pickup truck, I mean, you can make money. You're not gonna be rich by any means, but you can make some money. Help people out, move stuff. Cause a lot of people don't have pickup trucks, especially if you live in a city. Like I live in the city, so if you live in the city, you, you should be fine um, as far as getting work and stuff like that, which is good. And other news, uh, we are at we are past 1,000 subscribers, so I appreciate everybody for watching. All right, appreciate everybody for watching. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna do for my 1,000 subscriber video. Video, I'm not sure what I got planned to do for a thousand subscriber video. I am doing a giveaway. Okay, so thank thank for the guy in the comment. I will be doing a giveaway um, once I figure out how I'm going to set it up and what I'm actually going to give away. Uh, I'll let you guys know in the video. But in the meantime, I'll just keep putting out content to the side of uh, what I'm going to do, basically, as far as how I'm going to set this content. So I'm trying to figure out a system that I can have you guys like log into or something like, or like sign your name, where I can in a randomly pick a winner. So with, once I get that figured out and find a website, um, I'll start that up. But yeah, so let me finish driving to this place, guys. All right, we are basically here. If you could see out the window, you see a big white couch in the back. But um, yeah, we're basically here, guys. Slow, up, slow down, speed bump. Boop. Boop. All right, so I'm back home. The job's finished. Um, I got paid in cash. Normally, um, I get paid in Zelle cash up. Some other means of electronic pay. But today I got paid in cash. So I'll, I'll be able to show you a video of cash. Um, the job's done. Now, what I was telling you guys before is when you're working a job and you do other type of work, make sure you include the type of work. So for this guy, he does um, real estate. So he has a bunch of properties that he needs um, to get cleaned or move other stuff for. So I just brought it to his attention. 
I say, man, I do carpet cleaning, tile cleaning, tile and grout, marble polishing. He stopped me. He's like, top, he's like uh, marble polishing. He's like, yeah, I do, I do marble polishing. All right, cool, man. Oh, how much do you charge? And I give him my price. He's like, man, that's 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 75 cents cheaper than the other guy's going to charge me. I was going to pay him to do it. So I showed him my before and after pictures um, with marble polishing. So there'll be a marble polishing video coming up soon. Um, that type of work, I don't do alone. Um, I more or less do it with my dad. He does that type of work full time. And I do it part time, helping out stuff like that. I know how to do it, but I just do it with him. He, you know, he's like the overseer. Like, make sure this is done, this done, and we get the job done. So we'll probably do that job together. Um, that'll be a little, a little over $1,000. Um, it should take us about a half a day. Now, that's not to say a job takes that long. That's just how long it takes us to do a job because we've been doing it for so long. I've been working alongside my dad doing cleaning, polishing, anything cleaning related since I could, I think since I was 12. So I, I know pretty much the ins and outs, pretty much. Um, about getting certain things done as far as getting certain spots out, polishing certain types of uh, natural stone, um, stuff like that. So that job is basically secured. He'd say he definitely wants me to do it. Uh, I believe it's next month or the month after he wants me to get that done. So that'd be a little over a thousand dollars for today, aside from equipment and obviously pay my dad to help me out. Um, just take about a couple of hours, get that done, and that's it. So today's motivation is if you're in the if you're in a job and you have um, connections or you make contacts you make connections with people make sure you push yourself out there don't be quiet and shy and do just what you have to do and leave like if i was just to grab these couches guys and drop it off quiet don't say nothing leave okay i would have got a hundred dollars in it or 125 whatever but i would have missed out on the thousand dollar day that's down the road that's basically guaranteed he definitely wants me to do it he's like chris i definitely want you to do it man the price is good show me before and after and we're good so that job's can set now because I spoke. You got to make sure you push yourself. Push what you do. Push your brand. All right. Like I said, if you're an electrician, push that work. Hey, man, I'm an, I'm an investor. I got like 15 properties I manage. I'm trying to look for a new uh, electrical guy. Hey, I do electrical work. What? Really? How much you charge? Okay, cool. You know what? You're my new guy. Boom. You do that over and over again. You'll be, you'll be flooded with work and you'll make more money than you would possibly ever working for somebody else. Doing the same type of work. Now, I'm not saying when you work this type of stuff service industry you're gonna be rich but you'll be comfortable okay guys you will definitely be comfortable especially if you're doing it um pretty often like on almost a daily basis like five days a week four days a week whatever it is um you'll be good so that being said this is finished up um i'm home now i'm gonna shower relax try to get some sleep for tonight's shift guys because i have an overnight shift i have a 8 p.m to 6 a.m and then when i wake up i have a new business all right i have a new job tomorrow now it's not moving related and it's also not um, cleaning related. I'm holding out to show you guys my new business I started on the side. I've already made a little over $1,500 in the past two, three weeks um, with this type of business that I'm doing tomorrow morning. But I'm not gonna tell you guys yet. You guys don't have to wait for that video. Um, I wanna make at least like two grand even first, all right? Um, I've already bought my business insurance for it. I got my business name and all that stuff set out. So once I pass my 200, not 200, my $2,000 income goal from that business in a month, which is I want to say give me two, three weeks, maybe a month at most. Um, I'll show you guys what that business is and give you more insight on what I'm doing on that end. So I have been really busy, guys. I'm out there trying to make that money. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not gonna lie to you. I've been busy, not every day, but I've been pretty busy getting stuff done. So once again, thanks everybody for subscribing, checking out my video. Make sure you hit the like button because YouTube likes the like button for some reason. If you hit the like button, it just shows my content to more people who wants to learn about how to survive on your own without requiring to have um, a regular job, okay? Having multiple streams of income is the way to go. All right, guys? So appreciate everybody for watching. Catch you next one.